Coldest day in Boston so far this winter, and many people spent it on sidewalks in tents near Mass and Cass. Mayor Wu has vowed to remove the homeless encampment by January 12th, which is next Wednesday. But where will all these people go? As WBZ's Christina Hager shows us tonight, the mayor toured one possible place that's been off limits for years. It is full of potential. Mayor Michelle Wu stepping off a Boston fireboat after strolling through an overgrown harbor island. Walking in those spaces was, was quite eerie in some ways because I remember how busy and full they were. WBZ's I-Team got this exclusive view of the Long Island Drug Rehabilitation Facility that's been abandoned since the city destroyed the only bridge connecting to it in 2015. It was deemed unsafe. Now, Mayor Wu is up against her own deadline to clean up Boston's infamous homeless encampment downtown by next week. To help, she says, her team may bring Long Island back to life. No word on when or how people would get there. There was no better way to do this than to actually see the state of the docks out there and the buildings. After temperatures dip to the lowest point of the season so far overnight, these tents are still here. And workers at this warehouse terminal step past them every morning. They use the bottom of the cone and smash through the, my front window. Anthony Spinazzola, who runs New Market Cafe, says the grim scene outside his window was never this bad when Long Island was up and running. I hope the mayor can do something because this would be big for her first thing in term to, to be able to clean this up. Last month, cottages for homeless people went up on the grounds of Shattuck Hospital. But Mayor Wu hopes this could be an answer for the longer term. Every life that we can save, every person we can get housed, is a step forward that we're going to analyze. In Boston, Christina Hager, WBZ News.